Your house is on fire. You do not wish to offend the responding fire professionals, yet you cannot tie a bow tie. Step one, choose a bow tie that won't give people the impression that you wear oversized shoes and throw pies for a living. First things first, adjust the size of the bow tie by sliding the buckle to the correct number on the neck ring. Place the bow tie around your neck, ensuring that one end is two inches longer than the other. Cross the long end over the short end, and then pull the long end up and over the band you've created around your neck. How do you even do that? Pull the short end at its widest point into a half bow. That's a Windsor knot. Pull the long end over the center of this half bow. Hold everything in place by pinching the center of the half bow. There should now be a loop between the half bow and the band. What is wrong with you? Take the long end by its center and push it through this loop. Where did you come from? This will form the other half of the bow. Who hired you? Tighten the tie by pulling on opposite ends of the bow. Get off my set now! Continue until your tie is tight and straight. It probably won't look right the first time, but that just means your parents dropped you when you were a child. Play ball! Thank <laughs> you.